Thank you, Madam Speaker. To the bill. To the bill. I'm going to vote for this bill. It's time the facts are straight on OSP funding in Senate Bill 5533. To correct the carrier of this bill, it's been 28 years, not 16, since Oregon State Police began experiencing cuts. Spanning the terms of several Democratic governors and Democratic speakers. And to correct the majority leader from Clackamas County, didn't quite get his facts straight or correct. We did not reduce in 05 100 troopers. We actually added troopers. I was co chair, I know it very well. It's a nice try, but we didn't cut them. The representative from Hillsboro. You've had the opportunity to vote for 139 troopers, 24-7 coverage. In fact, you've had that opportunity seven times. It didn't reach the level of priority for that to be done. You had the opportunity about 45 minutes ago to do that. It would have only taken a little over 2.7% of the increased May forecast to provide 39 additional troopers. The good representative from Hillsboro, it didn't reach his priority list to do it. With over 2.5 billion, actually it's almost 2.7 billion dollars, the legislature had the opportunity to go even further and fully restore the cuts of the past. They don't want to. Thanks to a recovering economy that all of the folks will try and take credit for, we began to reverse these cuts last session. And we added more troopers. Additionally, during the previous interim, we added more troopers. Even with the $152 million in the May forecast, you can't find a measly $4.2 million to raise your priority to fund another 39 and reach 24-7 coverage. Speak the facts. You don't want to. You don't want to do that. Don't try and sugarcoat it and say, I want to do it. I just can't. $2.7 billion is a ton of money that you can't find 4.1 to do 24-7 coverage. Don't go back to your districts and say, I tried. I tried my hardest. I just couldn't find another $4.2 million. God, did I try. Instead, this bill shows the legislature is passing. Yeah, we're passing. Hold your nose and vote for it. To strengthen state police this biennium and for future biennium. You ain't going to get another chance to have $2.7 billion more dollars to do it with. So don't take that lousy 4.2 million that all of us would love to have. Don't take that and raise the police coverage to 24-7. Have the gutsy thing, have the courage to only do 100 and throw the other 4.2 million away. Toss it away. The bottom line is this budget shortchanges the patrol division and fails to get 24-7 coverage and we're all going to be part of it because we don't have the guts to find 4.2 million to do what every Oregonian out there wants us to do and put 24-7 coverage on the street. Push the green button and show you don't have the guts.